Well, welcome to People's Place. Or, hello, Mark. Hello, Stephen. Glad to be with you via, on People's Place via the web. Now, can you tell us uh, what the status of the project is? Uh, it's been in the works for quite some time, and just kind of give us an overview of the project and when we can expect Volume 1. Okay, gladly. Um, well, Volume 1 uh, ought to be out in uh, 2012. That's what we're aiming for. Um, so it's nearly there. I've been working on it for about eight years now. Um, the working title is The Beatles, The Complete Story. I don't know if it's going to stay that way, but that's what it is at the moment. And um, everything is on track, except that we're running a little bit behind time. But um, the idea of the book is, you know, it's, it's still exactly as it was back in 2003 when I, I first came up with it, which is that it's really an attempt to tell the Beatles story like it's never been told before. It's a, it's a well-told story, but I always contended that it was not a, a well-told story, if you know what I mean. Um, it's been told a lot, but never very well, and I always felt that it could be told better, and that's what the aim is, really, to absolutely get this right. I mean, the Beatles, you know, they, they are the biggest band of the 20th century, and they changed so much, and they're still huge in the 21st century, and yet... There isn't really the one book that absolutely explains how it all happened and, and looks at it properly, accurately, comprehensively, and with a kind of proper understanding. So that's the idea. Um, it's, <laughs> it's a vast job. It's uh, probably about a 20-year project, full-time. Um, but I'm very happy about that because it needs to be done, and I'm very happy to be the one who's actually doing it. So... 2012 is the date we're shooting for, and um, I'm just about on track for that. And your publishers? Um, well, I've been very, very happy uh, to say that my publishers have been really patient with me. Uh, they were expecting the first volume out in 2008, uh, and here I am in 2011 still writing it. So uh, I'm enormously grateful uh, to them for their patience. That's um, Little Brown in the UK, Crown in America, and Kuwait Shoba Shinsha in Japan. They've all been incredibly tolerant of this, but they've read the material, and um, they've read what I've written so far, and for that reason alone, I think they're staying right on track because this is going to be something very special. And, uh, I'm, you know, it's taking longer than we thought, but it is going to be worth the wait.